I think people are quite impressed when I show them the Doro. Not just with the foam, but with how far I've gone in exploring it. I'm Jill Wheeler, I'm 69 and I live in Killeen, which is outside Newport in South Wales. I've been a teacher all my life. I think it was 40 something years when I finished. I think when you've had a life so full of routine, it takes some time to adjust to not having that routine. I volunteer at a food bank. I wanted to do something with my time. And then this also gave me the chance to give back a bit. My generation now, I don't think we're as old as our parents were at this age. Forget the number, which is how I like to think of life generally, really. I've got two children, a daughter who we call Nikki. Nikki's got two boys, Daniel and Jacob. We go have days out, we go to the beach and rock climb and things like that. My son Matthew, well he was first in London and now he's in Copenhagen. And Matthew's daughter is Maggie. The advantage of being retired gives me the options to come and go as I please. If something is happening, for example in Copenhagen, I can go, whereas before I was tied to holiday times. There will be a lot of photos of the boys and when I'm in Copenhagen, equally, there'll be a lot of Maggie. <laughs> the general layout of the Doro, the icons, the whole screen is much clearer. Things aren't so squashed together, the space, and you can see what's there. I'm much less nervous about exploring because it's so clear on a Doro phone. I'm very into puzzles. The Doro is much easier than a lot of the puzzles I do. <laughs> 